dawn of a new era, the Four Call Breeds. If we are not going to retaliate, stoppable, undefeatable. You hear them once, you remember them twice. You may not even see it, but I used free stock footage from Pixel. Not only that, but all those voices you have heard in this trailer are text-to-speech. So if you shoot and use your human voices, you will definitely create a far way better movie trailer. So here is the very intro guys, there is nothing complicated here. Let me show you how you can create it, in few simple steps. So I will remove this one here and start creating the new. So I used this video of smoky background from Pixel. Add a default text. Then go advanced. You can move your text here so that you can see while you are changing the fonts. Then, for the text below, add a text. Then I will type motion pictures and change this font. Then for the customization of this text, go presets and choose this style 23. Come back to customize. Scroll down and change the shadow style, color, and then adjust the shadow distance as well. Now for the animation on the first text, go animation scroll down and take the zoom out. Move your play head to the point where your animation is ending then the text below will start right there. For its animation take the random. Well let's see how it's looking now. So I exported this for the sake of adding a transition, it had to be a single video. So these are the customizations I used in making this intro. So as we move on with timeline, here you can see this was just the glitch effect that I used. We may get spared by those evil four culprits. Please don't. The dawn of a new era. The four culprits. Here I was showing the name of the movie. So this was the video inside text. Let me just show you how you can create it in the next 30 seconds. We will use the same video of smoke on the background. So add a default text. Go advanced. Then you can customize the texts in your way. But here I reduce the opacity of the text. After you have your text like this, press OK. So now add a black image below this text. And you take a screen capture. Drop your screen capture above this R video. Double click the screenshot and go compositing and set it on darken. You are done. Now look at these two videos here, they have a good and same coloration. But if you check the original footage, you will see the difference. As you can see this video here is too exposed. So instead of color grading it, I just color correct it with the other video. Let me show you how you can do this color match. So let me drop this video into the timeline. Click this video and choose this feature right here, and go color match. Here Filmora will allow you to choose any frame from your video. Then if you find the frame you want to match with, you press match and your color match will be done. 
As you can see also that this video here is not what the original is. On the original, these people are advancing, they are moving forward. But here on my edit they are actually moving back. So it's simple to do this in Filmora. Just double click your video and go speed. Then click reverse. Undefeatable. Now here I want you guys to notice the technique I used to add this text. I used masks. So as you can see that the first half of this video is fading out as the text is coming. And then the second half also fades out as the other text comes. So let me quickly show you how you can fade out half of the video whilst the other half is still fully visible. Just go mask and select a single line. Then copy this video and paste it above. Invert the mask of the above video. After that you can apply the fade out. And you are done. You hear them once, you remember them twice. Now when it comes to techniques, or trick of editing a movie trailer, let me remind you the three basic tricks. One is teasing. A movie trailer is even called a teaser, that means you are not showing the full picture, but you are just highlighting. But this, a viewer is having an idea, but she cannot tell how the story went. And this teaser should contain the most interesting shots of the movie. Now let's check the second basic trick. I have described it as interlocking. While we are still finishing this shot here you already hear the sound of bikes. This actually gives the viewer a big expectation of the next shot, and will not leave before the end of the trailer. The last basic factor is the audio. This is also a major part. The big effort you put on editing clips, that's the same as your audio. Every action should go with the sound. Okay guys, if you may have any question about this video, you can drop it in the comments. So what you are going to do now is just to choose between one of those videos on the screen.